The Republic of Congo President Denis Sassungueso has hailed his re-election as the real will of the people. President Sassungueso emerged victorious in the first round with 60% of the vote. The results must now be validated by the Constitutional Court. Sunday's election came five months after a constitutional referendum removed a term and age limits that would have barred the 72-year-old leader from extending his 32-year rule. His supporters have high expectations. We are waiting for work for young people. He spoke of work and employment. We'll nearly have it all. He will bring modernity to the 12 regions of Congo. Meanwhile, the country's opposition candidate General Jean-Marie Michel Makoko is calling for civil disobedience, claiming the incumbent Denis Sassou Nguesso stole the election. Congo's opposition parties have demanded a recount. They say the election was marred by massive fraud. The European Union refused to send election observers to monitor the election. The official counts gave the runner-up Guy Bryce Parfait Colelas 15% of the vote, while Mokoko came in third with 14%. He believes that the blood of the Congolese people has been shed too much and does not want a bloodbath. What he asks for is simply for all the Congolese to undertake a campaign of civil disobedience by not going to work, not by taking part in public rallies which are banned. It's a slow process.